Hello, today's IELTS speaking lesson is all about food. What kinds of meals do you like? Oh, I like anything that isn't fried. My mouth waters at the sight of fish whenever I see cod or tuna. However, I don't have time to cook. That's why I often eat out or order takeaways, when I have the money. I eat canned food or ready meals when I am economizing. What kinds of meals do you like? Well, I live far from my family and we only get together a few times a year. Unfortunately, as for friends, I don't really have enough time for such occasions, due to my busy schedule. Do you often have dinner with your family or friends? I usually have my main meal at about 7 p.m. It's a bit late and I'm usually starving hungry by then, and sometimes I overeat. When do you usually eat dinner? Yes, there are, although I'm not a fussy eater, I really hate aubergines and celery. I avoid meals that contain these products at all costs. When do you usually eat dinner? Well, I love Italian cuisine for its versatility and tasty dishes. Italian cuisine comes from a variety of regions. Starting from their famous escalop Milanese and finishing with tiramisu. Also, it is usually natural and rarely uses artificial ingredients or flavors. Now, have a look at the card and prepare a monologue. Describe a place you like to eat at. You should say, where is it? What kind of food it serves? Why do you like its food? And how often do you eat there? I would like to share with you the address of a nice little restaurant that is only a stone's throw from my house. It is called La Dolce Vita, it is a little isolated about 10 minutes from the city center. This restaurant serves a great variety of dishes of Italian cuisine that I enjoy but that specialize in Neapolitan cooking. For example, they serve delicious pasta, and pizza. But they also offer Roman artichokes. I particularly love their Ozzo Buco. It has that lovely orange zest which complements so well the tasty beef and can be served with many vegetables. In general, I love Italian food because it is all about fresh, quality products and great ingredients. That's why I eat in that restaurant on special occasions with my girlfriend. Although it's not cheap, its quality means you don't feel cheated. How can we make people eat healthier food? It is my opinion that, it is up to the government to tax unhealthy junk food and subsidize healthy food. You should eat unhealthy food, ever so rarely, and pay a premium for doing so when you do. In this way you will be obliged to eat nutritious products most of the time. You must try not to abuse your health. Do you think people enjoy what they eat on a regular basis? On balance I would say not. People are often too much in a hurry or looking at their iPhone when choosing their meals. People snack with rubbish and are too stressed to savor their food. People tend to eat what they see on the adverts or that is quickly available. On balance I would say not. People are often too much in a hurry or looking at their iPhone when choosing their meals. Do you think that cooking is a pleasure or a burden for most people? I can only answer for myself, but I think that cooking is a pleasure, at least this way you know what you're eating. And with a bit of practice you can cook the food the way you like it. Although judging by the popularity of cooking programs, I would say people might love cooking. Maybe men more than women as it's a great way to switch off. In modern society women associate food with being fat, but with people in general, if it is their passion it is all consuming. But I'm among those people that love cooking and dining out. In fact I just love eating.